How to set up your home sleep test. Open the case and pull items out. You will notice there is a belt, a reusable pull socks or finger probe, a disposable pull socks or finger probe, a nasal cannula, the device itself, spare batteries, paper tape. We also use QR codes to help with instructions and paperwork that needs to be completed. Simply open your camera, scan the code, and click on the link to open that QR code. You will notice this one has a set of directions on how to use the device. Go back into your camera setting, scan the other QR code. This one takes you to forms. Please complete the questionnaire and HST form. These are needed for your report. Please take out the device, grab the belt, and click firmly into one end of the device. Then wrap around the chest so the device can be snug. If you need to loosen the device, simply lift the latch and slide as needed. You will also notice Once the device is in, that you will see a pie chart spinning. This lets you know the device is active and beginning to work. Let's continue placing the items on. Next, you want to use the reusable pull socks. This will slide on your finger. Do not place finger all the way through the end of the rubber tip and then connect firmly, matching the shapes, into the blue tail. Next item you need to grab is the nasal cannula. There will be two prongs. Those items will go in your nose, and the tube will wrap around both ears. There is an adapter to snug the cannula up as needed. You will then take the end of the cannula and simply twist into the silver tip until secured. Once all items have been placed, you will see lights. Those lights should all be green. If at any point a light shows yellow, simply ensure that portion is connected. First one here is for the finger probe. Second one is for the belt. Last one is for the nasal cannula. Just secure that item and continue with the test. Please do not hit the center button despite what the instructions say. We have found that this causes errors with the device. When you are completed with your test, simply unclick the belt, remove the finger probe, and take the nasal cannula off. You can then place items right onto the bedside table as needed. The device will remain on, but will turn off within approximately 20 minutes. If at any point you are unable to get the finger probe or pull socks to work correctly, please use the disposable pull socks included. You will notice there is dots, one to show that this is going to go on the top of the finger. This is going to go on the bottom of the finger and it will wrap around the finger securely. Go 
This is only to be used if you are unable to get the reusable pull socks to work correctly. You can also, if needed, use paper tape to secure items. You can simply wrap the cord to your finger and use the paper tape to hold on to the finger or wrist. You can also use it on your cheeks to help hold the cannula. If for any reason you need to replace the batteries, please take the spare batteries. You then take the device and open the back of the device, pop the batteries out and you can replace the batteries. Again, the batteries should last for two nights and should only be used if unable to get the device to turn on. Again, you want to use this device for approximately six hours. After both nights, simply return all items back to the case and return to our location. Good luck and have fun sleeping.